Building a campaign should not be that hard. There are five simple steps to take, and in this video, I'm going to show you how. Whether your campaign is promoting a new offer, getting your brand out in front of many people, or just keeping connected to your existing audience, you need to follow five simple steps. The first thing you need to do before you do any other activity in your campaign is you need to create a brand script. If you don't know what a brand script is, you can click at the top and there's a link to a video on it. Or in the show notes, you can actually click to a link to an entire article about brand script. Suffice it to say, a brand script tells a very simple story. Who is your ideal customer? What problem do they face? And why is it that they can't overcome it themselves? Why are you the authority? Why should they trust you to solve their problem? What is your plan? And if they follow your plan, what are the positive outcomes? And if they don't follow your plan, what are the risks? This is a brand script. And we create this whenever we do a brand new campaign. It allows us to build all the other components based on these decisions we make at the very beginning. The second thing you need to do, you need to create a landing page. Now that you have this brand script and you know who you're targeting and what problem you're solving and how you're going to solve it, you create a landing page. Now a landing page could be a standalone page or it could be just another page in your website, but it's a place for when somebody either clicks on a link or follows some message to learn more, this is where they end up. When you create a campaign, the last place you're taking them is to the home page on your website. You always want to take them somewhere that's very specific to that campaign. If you want to learn more about landing pages, you can actually watch our video on how to do the perfect home page. There are five things you need to have. And I'll do another video later that get into some of the other details of landing pages. But at this point, follow the rules of creating the perfect home page. Use your grand brand script and create that landing page. The third thing you need, you need some copy in the form of an email autoresponder. An email autoresponder is created to keep in touch with a contact that has engaged with this offer or this brand or this landing page. What you do is you write a series of three to five emails. And if you want to learn more, there's a link to the perfect autoresponder up here. You create the autoresponder so that the emails keep the message that entice the person to arrive on your landing page to continue learning more, ultimately to get them to take some action, which we'll talk more about at the final step. The fourth thing you need to decide and to create, well, you need to decide what channels you're going to use for your advertising. When you're creating a campaign, you need to determine how you're going to target the people you've defined in your brand script. In some cases, it's an existing list. You already have these contacts. You're already interacting with them. In other cases, it's done through advertising, through different channels like social media or search or display networks. Whether you're doing advertising through programmatic ads or you're doing an existing list, you need to understand where you're going to get the contacts and where those contacts are going to go. And then you need to write copy for that. If you're using an ad channel, you need to write copy for those ads in alignment with the landing page so that the ad and the landing page are in agreement, which ultimately supports that brand script that you've created. And the fifth thing you need to determine, you need to determine your measurement of success. What action do you want that person to take? When you're writing and creating that landing page, do you want them to fill out a form? Do you want them to pick up the phone and call? Do you want them to watch a video? Do you want them to go through a demo? What is your measurement of success? And you need to build your landing page and your ad so you could obtain the data necessary to measure that success. For example, if a measurement of success is a phone call, well, you need to obtain a phone number for call tracking specific to that campaign. Calls to that specific number then can be measured and recorded and you know exactly how well it's doing. If it's a form fill, you create a form specific to the, that campaign. If it's a video, you may create a version of the video for the campaign, or if it's an existing video, you may embed it in a place so that you know how the person got there. Again, tagging that engagement with the campaign so that you can measure your results. So that's it. Those are the things you need to do for a campaign. The first thing, you need a brand script. You need to know who this is going to, what problem they have, why they can't solve it, why you are the authority, why you can solve it, and what the positive and possible negative outcomes can be. 
You need to create this landing page, a place to take that person in the campaign to get them to take some action. You need to create an autoresponder to keep this in front of them through email and social media and other channels that can be engaged over time. You need to determine what you're going to use to get contacts into this campaign. Are you running advertisements or are you going to an existing list? And finally, you need to determine how you're going to measure success for this campaign and obtain those components and embed them in the landing page so that you can effectively measure the results. Every time you do a campaign, follow these five steps and you'll be assured to have the most successful campaigns and the numbers associated with them to know that they're working. I make videos like this all the time about marketing, business, mindset. If you're interested in any of that, subscribe and click the bell. I'd also like to hear if you do things differently in your campaigns. Give me a comment, let me know what you do and I would love to learn more about your methods. Thanks for your time today and I look forward to seeing you on the next video.